Welcome to my Power Yoga One. In this session, we will do a practice of relaxing the muscle. Very simple to do. So loosen up your shoes, take up your socks, and get ready for a nice, beautiful, gentle flow. All right, come into tabletop position. Spread your legs a little bit far apart, and shift your hips back. Placing your hands, straighten your elbows, palms facing down. Lay your forehead on the mat. Concentrate on an inhaling and exhaling through the nose. While you let your forehead enter the mat, just give your mind some space. We're gonna take a few moments to really relax the body, prepare it for this gentle yoga practice. And gently raise your head. Look up and sit up into tabletop position. You're gonna take a deep inhale and exhale, dome the spine into cat pose. Really feel the stretch of the back. If you got any strain, this is the perfect pose for this. Inhale. Bring your spine to neutral and let your stomach sink in and bring your head up. Exhale, come back into cat pose. Inhale, cow pose, let your tummy drop. Exhale, cat pose, really feeling the back. Inhale, Cow pose, bring your head up. Exhale, cat pose. Inhale, bring yourself into neutral. Tuck the toes and come up into downward facing dog, taking the tailbone up to the sky. Pressing the heels down to the earth. and pressing through the hands. Really enjoying a nice deep stretch throughout the whole back, from your armpits, to your lower back, to the hamstrings and calf muscles. You're welcome to walk the dog, ship the hips from left to right, and just remember, you don't have to have the heels down all the way. If you're not that flexible, that's okay. You're here to try your best. So enjoy the experience.
shift your body forward into a plank position. Stay right here, let your core be strong. Gently lower yourself down, all the way down. And from right here, bring your elbows forward into a diamond position. Raise your head up as far as you can, opening up that chest. Lay yourself down. Take an inhale. You know, raise your head up as far as you can. And exhale, bring yourself down. One last inhale, raise yourself back up. And exhale, bring your hands down. Next, take an inhale, chest. raise your chest up, open up that body in the front, really good stretch. And exhale, tuck the toes and bring yourself back up into downward facing dog. Adjust your feet if you have to. And from right here, you're gonna bend the right knee and shift the hips to the right, really stretching that left side of the body. And do the same thing on the left side. And from right here, you can step forward with the left foot and then the right into four fold. Really feeling a nice stretch of the hamstrings and the lower back. You can always come down to this pose whenever you want during the day. This is a perfect pose to really get a good stretch. Hold your shoulders with your hands and your arms, letting the be a weight to pull you down more for a deeper stretch. You don't have to do this. It's only if you really want to get a deeper stretch. And from right here, you're going to gently put your hands on your shins and straighten your back into half that back. Exhale, bring yourself down. Slowly, vertebra by vertebra, bring yourself up gently, really slow. Take an inhale, raise your hands up to the ceiling. Exhale, put your hands into prayer, into heart center. Really focus on the prayer, feeling the meditation in your heart. From right here, let go. Inhale, circle the arms up, and exhale, gently bring yourself down into fourfold. Put your hands on your shins, take a half lap back. Exhale, step back into plank and gently slower down all the way to the ground. Untuck your toes. Take a nice inhale, rise up your chest. Hold it here. Really feel that nice, nice stretch. Exhale, come down. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, come down, tuck the toes, and come up into downward facing dog. Step up with your right foot and your left. Put your hands in your shin into half that back and forward fold. Inhale, use your glutes, stand up. Exhale, four fold. Inhale, half that back. Exhale, step back into plank and gently slow down. Take a nice inhale, rise up. Exhale, calm down. 
inhale rise up hold and exhale come down tuck the toes and come up into downward facing dog Inhale, push back. Exhale, step forward, top of the mat. Inhale, half that back. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rise up, hands in the air. Exhale, hands in heart center. Inhale, rise up. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half that back. Exhale, step back into plank and gently lower down. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, gently come down. Take one, inhale, and raise the legs up with the toes and exhale, come down. Inhale, tuck the toes and come into downward facing dog. Press the face back and step forward with the left foot and the right into four fold inhale half that back exhale four fold with strength inhale rise up exhale hands and prayer inhale up exhale four fold can inhale half that back and exhale, step back into plank and gently lower down. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, come down. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, lower down. Tuck the toes into downward facing dog. Step forward with the right foot only. Stay on your toes with the back foot. From right here, take your right hand, place it on top of the right knee, and turn your hips to the right, holding the left hand firmly to the ground. Get a nice little twist. You really feel a nice twist. Bring your, your hands down and step forward with the left foot into forward fold. Inhale, half that back. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, bring hands into heart center. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half that back. And step back with the right foot, keeping your left foot right there. Place your left hand on top of your left knee and twist to the left side of the wall. Really feel that nice stretch on the left glute. Stay on your toes or you can drop your knee down anytime you like. From right here, come down, put your, place your left hand down, step back into downward facing dog, get a nice deep stretch, come into plank and gently lower yourself all the way down to the ground. Untuck the toes, inhale upward facing dog, exhale come down. Inhale, upward facing dog, deep stretch. Exhale, come down, tuck the toes, and get ready for downward facing dog. Feel that good stretch. Raise the right leg up to the sky. Step forward between the hands. Adjust. Move your right arm in between the right knee. Bring your left knee down and come down on your elbows in the diamond position or stay up with your arms it's up to you at your own comfortability at your own flexibility honor where you're at never force the body 
if there's any pain, then this move might not be for you. Or simply just be with your hands and arms straight. No need to force the body if it's not ready to go deeper. Stand up with your hands. Put your right hand over the right knee. Tuck the toes and step forward the back foot a couple steps and straighten your right knee as much as you can. It doesn't have to be all the way straight. You can keep the right knee soft, bent, or you can straighten as much as you can. You're welcome to use a yoga block Or you could put your hand on top of your right shin. Remove the block, step forward with the left into forward fold, hug the shoulders, inhale, half flat back, exhale, forward fold, inhale, rise up, exhale, bring your hands in prayer, inhale, rise up. Exhale, four fold. Step back with the right foot into runner's lunge. Bring your left hand in between the left knee. Drop your elbows down into a diamond position and bring your right knee down, untuck the toes and really feel this deep stretch in the left inner thighs. Breathe. Strain your hands. Look up. Tuck the toes. Step up with the right foot. Straighten your left knee. You can bring your left hand on top of the left shin or use a yoga block for that nice deep stretch in the left hamstrings. Bend the left knee, step back with the left foot into tabletop and press up into downward facing dog. Feel that deep stretch and little by little walk back with your hands, meet halfway and walk the rest of it back until you hit a four fold. Grab the elbows and then put your arms behind your back, interlace your hands, strain the elbows and bend it back behind you. Feel the nice deep stretch in the shoulders. Breathe. Bring yourself back, come into half that back, put your hands in the mat and walk forward 
sit into tabletop. Sit up forward and gently lay your butt down the between the feet. Put your hands behind your back. Gently, if you can, bring yourself down on your elbows behind your back. Feel the nice deep stretch in the quads. If this is too much, bring one leg bent forward and lay your back against the floor and bring your arms behind you for a deep stretch all through the front of the body. Straighten the left leg. Enjoy. Gently rise up with your elbows. Bend the left knee, straighten the right leg. Bring the left knee behind you. Come into your elbows behind you. And gently lay your body back down to the floor. And feel that nice deep stretch in the left quad. Bring your hands all the way back behind your back. Feel that nice deep stretch. Always to remember to breathe. Gently press yourself back up and with your elbows. Bring both feet together. You can either stay right here or bend forward. If you have lower back problems, just stay up. You don't need to go full forward. Extend the elbows for a deeper stretch. Sit up. Let go of the legs. Straighten them. Take a nice inhale and four fold. You could place your hands on top of the shin or if you go further, grab the feet. And those who are more flexible can lay their head on top of their knees. Breathe. Sit up and gently sit your butt down and lay your back on the floor. Rest. Lift your right ankle, put it on top of the left knee, raise your left foot up, and in between your right leg and left leg. Sweep your arms in front. You can either hold behind the left hamstrings or sweep up into the left knee and pull. Feel this nice deep stretch in the right inner thigh. Gently let go and switch sides. Bring your left ankle on top of the right knee. Bring your arms in between the legs. Hug the hamstrings or the right knee and pull. Let go of the left leg all the way to the floor. With the right arm extended to the side, keep it grounded to the floor and twist your right knee to the left with your left hand. 
and feel a nice deep stretch in the lower back and maybe even the right hip. Remember to always breathe deeply. Bring yourself back to neutral. Let go of the right leg. Bring the left knee to the chest. Bring the left arm extended to the side and twist the left knee to the right. And feel the nice deep stretch in the left side of the lower back. Breathe. Bring your left knee back and your right. Hold the foot with your hands. Shift your knees towards your chest. Hold. And you can rock your feet from left to right. You can hold from the inner feet or outer. You can even hold right from the front of the toes. And this is called Happy Baby. One of my favorites. Straighten your knees for a deep halfway plow. Really gets a full deep stretch all through the lower back to the hamstrings, even the calves. From right here, bring it down, hug the knees, bring your head close to the knees and hug. Love yourself. Gently let go of the legs. Sha Vasana. All I want you to do now is to breathe. And focus on the space of peace. Namaste.